Hey YouTube, this is Brittany. I'm just making a quick haul video, just like a mini one. Um, it's for, oh, excuse me, Urban OG. It's a shoe site. So let me just go back a little. Um, I have big feet. Yeah, I'm just gonna put it right out there. Um, I generally wear a size 10. If the shoe is narrow, I tend to get an 11. Um, and it's so crazy because I'm only like five foot five, yet and still I wear a size 10 or 11. And it's very rare that I find cute shoes. Like, I'm always seeing these cute shoes for these, you know, little dainty feet girls. But, uh, yeah, that's not me. So, anyway, um, a couple months ago, my friend put me onto this site. And I went on there and I fell in love. Because, of course, you know, you're able to search by your size and whether it's pumps, um, thigh high boots. But, you know, I don't really do the thigh high because I got a little thick thighs. But anyway, moving right along. Um, they have flats, sandals. I mean, and they even sell accessories and clothes. I didn't really, like, purchase any clothing or anything. I was just looking for shoes. So I just want to show you guys what I got. Um... Okay, this first one, I may have to just go back a little because uh, it's kind of... So, I got a riding boot. Yeah. It's in black. They had it in tan, too, and brown. But I really wanted the tan one as well, but they didn't have my size, and I just didn't know how it would fit. So, I didn't, you know, just stuck with the size that I know. These are an 11, and they fit really well. Like, I mean, I have space in there. I just... I'm good. So, that's one. Then I got these chunky boots. You know, I like a little little cowboy boot, a little western looking boot. And this is Plain Jane. This shoe was like on sale for maybe $11 and like 80 cents. I don't know exactly. I don't remember how much because I did buy it a couple of months ago. I just, yeah, it's been sitting there chilling. Um, This one I got is a little booty. So, I don't normally do heels. I, mean, I didn't even tell you guys. Like, I don't like heels. I'm like a flat sandals and like you saw the little boots like a little bit of heels like a little chunk that's that's me so I want to branch out I want to try to wear some heels let's see how some of it goes right so I got these these came in a ton of other colors too but I just really like the black one it's cute and then we move on to these pumps that I purchased that I just L O B E. Okay, so I'm the type of person that when I find something that I like, whether it's in a shirt or something, I'll get it in not all the colors it comes out in, sometimes all depending on what it is, but the majority of the time, like I'll get like at least two or three. So I got this shoe. Oh, Y'all are not understanding, like I fell in love. Now, I have these other shoes from DSW that I bought like last year or something. And for me, the platform is clutch for comfort. Like, I mean, like I feel like I'm wearing a pillow. I know, it sounds weird with heels, but the platform does something to kind of balance it out and you don't feel like you're putting too much pressure on the ball of your feet, which is what my issue with heels and the lack of why I wear them. So I got it in the gray. Hope you guys can tell really that it's gray. Oh, and this is gold right here. And then this color, y'all. Ooh, I just love this color. Look, okay, it looks kind of bluish. Maybe it's because of my pink shirt, but it's teal. Like it's just sexy, and it still smells like new shoes. Like I have an obsession. Like I could sit here like, like all day, all day. Anyway, so. I'm going to post up some pictures so you guys can see what it looks like in its natural light because I think the computer kind of alters the lighting a little bit. Um, and I'll also post the website. I'm sure you guys, if you guys check it out, if you haven't heard of it before, it's urban, www.urbanogsandgeorge.com. I'll put it right down at the bottom. Um, yeah, just... I, I'm just super excited. I hope you guys take a look at it and let me know what you guys think. If you guys made any purchases from there, 
if you had any bad experiences or any good ones. Oh, and they have, might have codes still for like free shipping or like a couple percentage off. I'd rather free shipping because depending on where you are and what type of shipping, shipping could be a lot more money. But if you like check to see what the price is going to be before you actually complete your purchase, you'll know exactly which one's the better deal. But yeah. Okay, so I'm going to post some pictures and um, you guys let me know what you think.